Hello there ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Scum single player episode. So, I've been rather busy today. Um, I went to a bunker, I managed to get a D3 key card. And remember what I said in the previous episode? I said we'd be doing a kill box today. We'd be doing a kill box in the next episode. Today is that next episode, or this episode is that next episode. So, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be doing it solo. I've got a bunch of... Uh, <coughs> Handy stuff here. There's my key card. There's my screwdriver. There's my pliers. Now, um, apparently I'm supposed to have rubber gloves with the, for this. But I'm not going to bother. Because I, 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 I don't have any. So, uh, <laughs> I mean, we could probably pick some up. We are going to D3. We are going to the D3 bunker, which is situated right here. It's a rather small uh, bunker. But, as you guys know... The puppets are deadly, so we just have to watch out for them. And I'm only going to be taking in an MP5. I'm going to be taking in my helmet. Yes, I've got some spares in the house, so hopefully I don't die. Uh, we will be building a bed as soon as we get there. So let me just uh, let me just grab some uh, some rags or a bit a bit some clothing. In fact, there should be loads of rags in here. One, two, three, and we need some rope. Where is all ye rope? Rope, 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 rope. None there. Let's check in the house. Anything in here? What we got? Rope, 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 rope. Where's the rope? Where is it? Where's all the rope? Wait, in fact... No, because I can take the prom mines. A lot of people have been asking me about the zombies. Can you use... Can you use the uh, the mines on the zombies? Yes, you can use the mines on the zombies. We actually found out firsthand that we could do that. Right, so there's none in there. Did I double check in here? Uh, ooh, 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 mm -hmm. You know what? <clears throat> when we get there, I'll just make some. I'll just. Oh my god! I didn't even realize this was out here. Oh, look at all this stuff! Look at all my stuff. M16s, AKs. There's so much stuff here. Right. Okay. Let's go. Let's just. Let's just go. Let's just go. Right. We're going to D3. We're going to Delta 3 today. Uh, I will need to stop off at the petrol station just uh, northeast of me. So, we need to fill up the car. Now, let's get on to some juicy stuff. Tomislav and the Scum, hand, scum Twitter handle have revealed some information regarding the, uh, the patching and health work. Or at least the damage system in terms of hemorrhaging in this game. At the moment, it's a work in progress, but it's just to give a rough breakdown of what they're actually working on. Now, they're working on a lot of stuff, but this is, uh, this looks kind of complicated, if I'm going to be honest. There's methods of healing, there's methods of patching, there's methods of, di like, different fixes for different things. Like, you'll need, like, if you lose blood, you need a blood transfusion. You've got a large gash on your arm or your leg. You need to sew up, etc. These are going to be some serious de details. <clears throat> They've already spawned in. Okay. Also, if you hear me kind of clearing my throat from time to time, uh, it's hay fever season, and I suffer from it. So, I do apologise if you hear me kind of clearing my throat every now and again. Okay, let's just... Uh, zap him. Oh, that's not an exploder. That's an exploder. <laughs> there should be one more. I see you. See, me and the boys have been playing uh, squad as of late, and I'm not. I, I'm. I'm not going to toot my own horn. I'm getting pretty good at the shooting in that game, <clears throat> and I think it's transferring across to this game because I'm landing more shots than I than I usually do. There we go. That might be it clear now. That might be us clear now. I could be lying. Yep, I lied. I lied. That was a blatant lie. Oh! There we go. Single shots only. 
Wait a minute, what the hell? Where? Trash monkey. Right, there we go. Let's go grab the car. God damn. How many bullets did I go through there? Haha, <laughs> plenty of them. Plenty of them. Let's unload that, jam that in there, and put that in there. Okay, we're down one magazine now. Yeesh. And we still need to get into the bunker. We still need to do... I need a gas mask. I'll get one at the bunker. I'll get one at the bunker. There'll be one. There will be one there. There will be one there. I mean, hopefully I can get out before this, the... You know, the gas kind of starts to fill the room. I don't know if I've got one in here. I don't. I don't seem to have one in here, which means we need to get one at the bunker. Unfortunate, but... You know, that's just the way it goes. Now, another thing that Thomas Love posted out was the new health resort. No, it's not called health resort. It's called the, the the water resort. I keep calling it the health resort because of Tarkov. It's the it's the water resort. And it's going to be down here in Zulu Zero along this stretch right here. You see this grey patch of area right here along to this little... Uh, it's like a swing back, a little U, a little U-turn in the land right here. We swing back. It's going to be right up to there, and it's going to have all sorts of buildings in it. It's going to have high-rise ones. It's going to have like big sauna locations. You know, get, get your traditional-looking spa. You know, very, very clean-looking. Obviously not now because it'll be absolutely riddled with puppets. It'll be absolutely stanking. <laughs> All the water won't be white or blue, it'll be it'll be manky, it'll be dirty, it'll be loaded with feces, it's gonna be crap. <laughs> but that's gonna be a really nice POI. The devs have said as well that they won't be planning to expand the map anytime soon until the current map is currently filled with things that you and I, the viewer, can go and explore. That we can go and check out. Obviously we've got the main 4x4 uh, sectors which are currently full to the brim with all sorts of stuff but we've also got the new Zulu sectors and we've got the Zero sectors which don't have a lot of stuff it's only as of late that we got the uh, the motor pool put up in uh, Delta Zero we've still got uh, another 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 another 8 sectors to fill with stuff now that's that'll probably be drawn out throughout this year and probably next year. I don't. I don't really want to call it though. I don't want to call it. They could. They could be working on multiple, and they might just re release them each month until the end of the year. That would be. Th if they did, that would be so cool. That would be so cool. Right. We have to go through this city a wee bit here. I'm still not a fan. I'm, right. Okay. I love the city. I do love the city. The way that it looks. The way that it feels. You know. The kind of ominous presence of like burnt out locations, things that are on fire, things that are still smouldering, but I'm not a fan of it. I'm still not a fan of it. Purely because, I think it's because of my puppets and the puppets on my multiplayer server that make it so difficult, but running through here is a death sentence, and I've, I'm sure a lot of you have seen the episodes where I've either died or have been very close to it, you know, and we've, uh, we've had to bail on objectives just to and that, the staggering, that is, but that's only because of my settings. The staggering only happens because of my settings. Any vanilla side of this, it wouldn't stagger. It's only because of my settings. But, um, <laughs> I'm still hesitant to go through the city. Even, even in, uh, even in other servers, I'm hesitant to go through the city because it's such a big place. Landed it. <clears throat> Landed it. Also, uh, one other thing, apart from the throat clearing, uh, there are a, a bunch of nesting blackbirds uh, out the back here. I have my window open because currently in Scotland, it's a weird temperature. It's like in the 20s, which is weird. I'm not used to it. It's horrible and mixed with hay fever season. It's not It's not fun. Pollen season. It's not that fun. And uh, you might occasionally, the mic might occasionally pick up little beeps from the blackbirds outside is because the magpies are going too close to their nests and they're defending the nests. That is, if you hear the beeping, it's most likely them, okay? It's not me, I don't go beep. <laughs> right, 
we're almost there, and I'm I'm still not prepared for this. I'm I'm in no way, shape, or form prepared for this. I don't do kill boxes. I don't normally do kill boxes. A lot of the time, most of my most of my scum time is roaming around the map, either in a vehicle, living out of my vehicle, or it's uh, I've missed the turn off, haven't I? Have I? Did I miss the turn off? No, I didn't. It's up the road a wee bit. Yeah, most of my time is spent as a hobo in this game. I don't normally have bases in this game because it's too easy to lockpick nowadays and C4 is very destructive. So I like to live a very minimalist style in Scum. I don't like to have bases. I like to have my vehicle. I try and keep it as camouflaged as possible. I tend not to take white vehicles or brightly coloured vehicles. I tend to take either black or camouflage. If it's in the... What the fuck was that? What was that? <laughs> what was that? Ooh, I don't, uh, 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 I don't like that. Not a fan of that. Not a fan. Random explosions don't usually sit well with me. Okay. Whew, we're here. We're here. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> we're here. Again. Not prepared. Don't know what that was, though. What is going on? What the hell is going on? <laughs> what just happened there? Okay. We need to time this correctly, because the last time I did this, I kind of humped it. I kind of ruined it. Why are you coming over here? You can walk behind these things. No, you didn't hear a thing. Walk away. Please walk away. Come on. Go back to your patrol route. Is there another? No, there's not. Damn it. Wait. There we go. That's our, that's our cue. Quick. Quick, quick, get in. Woohoo! Shut door. Shut door. Okay. Now we just have to take our time here. Just take our time and we'll be alright. Now I'm going to hold here for a second because uh, there's going to be more coming down. There will be more coming. Just shuffle forward a wee bit. <coughs> it's a bit. Yeah. There we go. Donked. Oh, it's shut. It's shut. The way is shut. The way is closed. The way is closed. Okay, the armories are just up here. No, they're not. That's a lie. Where are the armories in here? Oh, dear. Back up a wee bit. There we go. Rattled. Brr. Oh, that's a nice bayonet. I'm not here for loot, though. I'm not here for this loot. I'm here for the... I don't like that thing being that close to me. I really don't like it being that close to me. <laughs> Same. Um, let's double check these offices. These offices will usually hold something good. Nope. Anything, 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 anything to make me smile? Nothing to make me smile. Yeesh. Okay, let's check these offices. Bad guys in here? No bad guys in here? Water bottles. Nothing, nothing, uh, nothing. Wait a minute, I know where the armories are in here. I'm silly. They're right here. They're here and to the left. Okay, he's dead. 
Come on. Could you perish already, please? Thank you. Okay. Oh, how good am I? Look at that. Look at that. Well played. Well played. Okay, two armories. We can make use of these. Oh, I told you. Did I not tell you guys? Did I not tell you? Did I not say? Oh, ah, there's one just outside. There's one just right there. <laughs> Hi. Let me just unlock these. Realistically, I shouldn't be doing this. I shouldn't be doing this, actually. I shouldn't be unlocking these. I've got I've got the key card. I shouldn't be using these. I'll need to go back out to my car. I'll need to go back out to my car. I need to go back out to my pickup truck. That's where the, all, all the advanced stuff is. Oh, feudal, you tube, you tit, you absolute idiot. Ugh. Plenty of MP5 magazines, though. That's uh, that's that's actually kind of good. That's actually kind of useful. Kind of need that. Put it in there. And this one. 30 out 6. Fight. Oh! Gun! Woo. There's one inside the armory. There's a gold deagle. I've not seen one of them in yonks. <laughs> All right, game. If you're gonna play it like that, this place is bad. This place is dangerous. I don't like this place anymore. Right, I'm not. I'm not gonna waste any more ammo. Oh, why is there so? I said I'm not gonna waste any more ammo, but I'm. <laughs> Sorry, let me just stick in this corner. He's about to blow up. I did shoot him right in the noggin. I said I was gonna build a bed here as well. Jesus. Blow up already. Please blow up. Please blow up. Don't you dare come through that wall. Thank you. Oh, what a mess. What a bloody mess. <clears throat> right, let's locate the... Uh, let's locate the, the kill box. It might, be, it might just be down here. Locate the kill box. Okay, clear down there. It's not up here. Okay, so it's not this way. It's the other way. Oh, Christ. Okay. Shut that door. It's down back where we were. It's around this way. That's a mess. It's this way. through there. It's through this door. Okay. I actually held my breath there. I won't lie. <laughs> I held my breath. Right, any more problems down here? Right, so there's the kill box. Okay. I need to go out. I need to go back outside. Um... Because I need my advanced lockpicks and stuff like that. I basically need all the stuff that I brought here to come in here. I need to use the, I need oh, I need to use the hiking backpack. Ah, oh, I'm not saying the hiking backpack's a bad backpack. I know a lot of people find it useful for transport. Oh, I have an idea, but this might get me killed. I'm just gonna take two of these. I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna leave this at the door. I'm gonna leave this right here. Okay, crafting. Let's get a little cot going. 
There's our cot. Build it there. I should be able to just mash E on or F on this. Why can I not mash F? Oh, it's because I've not got this on. There we go. E. I need more. I need more. I need more. I need more. Ha ha! Cut into rags. I've also got paper in my. Ugh. Inventory's a bit of a mess here, folks. I do apologize. <laughs> Oh, right. We need some sticks, and we need rope. Uh, check in here. Can I cut you? Oh, I can cut you into a skin. That's kind of interesting, though. That the you can cut those bags, or cut those things into into skins. Right. Take this, and we'll leave the bag there. Leave that there. We need to go out and get. We need to go out and get our stuff anyway. So we'll just have to. Make do. Right, take that. Right, what's this got in it? <clears throat> right, that's fully ready to go. Right, we're just going to sprint out here. There we go. I could be a guide for this place now. Right, we just have to open up. Oh, don't go that way. Come on. Oh, shit. Oh god. That's him dead. There's one that <laughs> he fell. He fell over. Right, I don't I don't want to alert I don't want to alert the sentry just yet. I don't want to alert him just yet. Because if I alert him now, uh, then I can't get out of here. Or I can't get back in rather. And I need that puppet to piss off. Go over there. Right, as soon as he turns his back to me, I'm going to make my way out to the left. And go. He'll see me, though. Go. Oh, shit. But, 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 this is okay. This is all right. This is perfectly fine. Now we can do this. Look. Look, 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 look. Look at all that. Look at all that. In fact, I'm going to take a katana with me. Come on, then. Come on, then. Come on. Dumbass. Right. Rope. There's the rope. That's the rope that I needed. That's the rope that I was looking for this whole... <laughs> this whole episode. Yep, we use katanas to cut down trees nowadays, ladies and gents. This is what we do here. Okay, uh, that's two. I need three. I need three long sticks. Cut down. Cut down. Cut down. Thank you. I like how he... He really... He, re he holds the blade! He's holding the blade! <laughs> Sir, do you still have fingers? That's that one. We're going to put that inside the hiking backpack. Now, one thing that I think the, the devs should include with backpacks is the ability to, to put add-ons to backpacks. Uh, for anybody that doesn't know what I mean here, if you look closely at the hiking backpack, there's a lot of areas where you could put D-clips. Those D-clips, you could obviously put additional things. Like, for example, you could probably put the, uh, the military quiver and attach it to this. You could attach it to the bag. It doesn't have to hang. It doesn't have to slip. Oh, excuse me. It doesn't have to sling off to the right or off to the left. It could it could literally fit on the side of this. I think that would be really cool. I think that would be a really nice feature to have in this game. Right. Okay. Uh, right. This is all I have. This is all I've got. And the other screwdrivers are in the other backpack. Right, now we need to get back inside. Oh, ladies and gents, here we go. This is the moment of truth, really. Don't you dare stare at me.
hiding here. Ha, you don't see me, loser. You know when they actually came out and said that the, the sentries can't actually see you in the bushes? I was really surprised by that. Because these things have got a really deadly line of sight. Like, they can engage you from over 100 metres away. Right, that's our dip time to go. There we go. Oh, he actually spotted us, but that's alright. That's okay. I'm going to keep that door open. Okay, ladies and gents, this is where we do the kill box. This is kill box time. Oh, this is going to be so... This is going to be agony. This is going to be sore. There's a lot of things. A lot of things can go wrong here. And they probably will go... It probably will go wrong, but first I need to build my bed. That's the direct route we have to go. Down here. Shut that door. Okay, three big sticks. No, 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 no. Uncraft. Don't craft a standing torch. <laughs> Got a little bit panicked there. Okay, that's the bed built. Bed is ready to go. Uh, we're going to clear this of miscellaneous items. We're going to equip that, even though it doesn't make sense. Okay, right. Lockpick, lockpick. Put that... Take that, take that, take that. Um, take that. Take that and that. Take extra bullets. In fact, I'll just fill up the ones that I've got here. Oh, I'm, I'm getting a wee bit nervous at this. This is getting a little bit nerve-wracking. Even just preparing for this. Okay, we've got lots and lots and lots of stuff here. I don't want to lose. Um... Before we go in, let's just repair this. And repair this. I'm going to keep that on me. I'm going to keep those on me. I'm going to stash these two here. And not take all of my ammo, because that's just silly. Right. I'm very nervous. <laughs> I'm very nervous right now. Okay, we're going to take that off, and we're going to keep that there. Painkillers on. Uh, gloves off. Keep the gloves in there. I don't need my compass. I can save that. Okay. You know what? Just see for this. I'm not wearing my helmet. I'm saving my helmet. I am not wasting that. That is a good helmet. Okay. Uh. <laughs> you can can anybody sense how nervous I am right now? <laughs> I'm very nervous right now. Okay. Are we ready? Three, two, one. How dare you enter my lair, scumbag? Oh, just kidding. No reason to be afraid. No more than usual, that is. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh. Stop, 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 stop. Just stop. There we go. Okay, let's try here. That one. Oh, oh. Oh, really? Come on, one over here. Okay, he's dead. What? 11 minutes left? Woo! Oh my god. It ain't good. Go cry somewhere else. There's the other one. Ah, oh my god. Okay, that's them dealt with. Oh my god! No, 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 no! Okay. I'm alright. Okay, take my time here. Ooh, that one. That one. Oh my god, I almost had it!
Okay. How? Let's try this again. Oh, that one. That one. Oh, almost had it. Load, 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 load. Oh, this isn't good. Woo! Die! Oh my god. Right, reload, 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 reload. <laughs> Five minutes left already. Come on. Okay. Ammo's good. Ammo's good. Uh, let's quickly let's quickly patch up. I've not even got through any of these doors. <laughs> what is that smell? Okay, here comes the gas. I sure hope here comes the gas. No, Google, not right now. <laughs> right, let's try this one more time. That that one. Oh my god. Oh my god. Reload. Load, 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 load. Katana. Oh my god. Jesus! I'm I'm absolutely useless at this. Okay, um I don't have a lot of bullets left. I don't have a lot of bullets left. What's even in these? Really? Oh come on. <laughs> oh guys, we wait. In fact, Okay, quit, 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 I quit. And that would be all. The only thing left here is a swift and painless death provided by our lasers. I highly recommend. Okay, so I failed, but at least this time I didn't die. At least this time I didn't die, guys. Okay, cut me some slack here. I'm getting the hell out of here. Ooh. Okay, so what did we learn from this? Uh, I shouldn't do kill boxes. I shouldn't do kill boxes ever. Not very good at them. <laughs> Not very good at kill boxes as it as it turns out. But you know what? Let's just pick up. Uh, let's just pick up loads of gear here. It's not like I can't pick up a load of stuff here. Activated charcoal. Sardines. I'll take some sardines for my pain. Take some trousers. Knuckle dusters, you know. <laughs> maybe I should maybe I should do this with someone. Maybe I should do with us do, do this with another player, like on my multiplayer server. I mean overall I didn't die. I only took one hit. I only sustained one hit. But all the loot's still back there, and I didn't even get through any of the rooms. I didn't even get through any of the fucking rooms. Right, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna bank all that stuff that I've found here. You know what? There we go. Put that in there. Oh, a nice black one. I'll take the black one. Yeah. I can feel a lot of people judging me right now. <laughs> I know I'm not good at them, guys. I know I'm not good at this. I know I'm not good at the kill box. I'm just trying to have a little bit of fun. That's all. Nothing about this game's serious to me, you know. E take that. I'll take that. Uh, put that in there. That in there. Put that in there. Take this too. There we go. I mean, at least I'm getting out with something, right? I'm not. I'm not going empty-handed. Oh, there's another. In fact, no. I'll just leave that. Just leave that. Don't need another one. I've already got two. <gasps> Yum. Okay, let's go this way. Have you assholes respawned yet? No, they haven't. They haven't respawned yet. Not yet. 
Ah, I think I found a bit of a problem. Uh, game developers, that's a bit of an issue right there. In my right hands. <laughs> In my right hand, sorry. Might want to deal with that. There's a few, there's a few little breaks like that uh, kicking around the place in this game at the moment after that uh, that hot fix. There's been a few little breaks here and there, but I think they'll get patched out in no time. There'll be a hot fix maybe next week or the week after that. They're probably collecting all the data for it anyway. So, oh, it fixed itself. It fixed itself. But there are still some little there's there's little bugs like that. They will be around. Okay. Not going home empty-handed. I'm taking home some stuff. It's like at the end of one of these, uh, like, PvP uh, events where everybody's kind of just scrounging around. The losing side just scrounges, scrounges the ground for all the, the leftovers. That's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm doing right now. Kind of just hovering about the scraps. I wasn't able to get into the, the kill box, which is unfortunate. But, it, you know what? I don't really care. I don't mind. Oh, it still works. It still works. It still works with my... Hello. That's another prom mine. Thank you. I like these mines. I really like the, the look of the prom mines because they... They look like actual anti-personnel mines. Look like the ones that they would place in the... The open fields in Normandy and stuff like that. Right, let's go through here. Lots of lots and lots of smokes, different coloured smokes as well. Uh, actually, unpack all this ammo. Drop that in there. Restack these magazines. Come on, there we go. Okay. Won't lie, I'm still a wee bit shaky from that. I'm still a little bit. Oh, prom mine. Still a little bit nervous from it, but. I tried my best. I tried my best. I tried to get... It's it's not so much the lock picking that I seem to struggle with. It's the... The the diffusal. It's, it's the wires that really mess me up because my eyes look at the wires and then they follow one wire and it, mag it magically transfers into another one and I'm like, oh, that's not the right one. What one is it? <laughs> it really bugs with my eyes. I think that's the main reason I can't get it. Like you could, you saw firsthand, like how close I could get to some of them, but most of them were like, "Nah, you ain't getting this." <laughs> I end up looking like a chameleon half the time, eyes going left and right, trying to figure out if I'm actually going the right way with the wires. Let me just hide in here. You cannot see me. I'm holding like a little purse. Look, there's my wee purse right there. <laughs> right, as soon as he turns his back, we're going to make our way out. And go. There we go. Sorted. Sorted. Sorted, ladies and gents. Right, what I'm going to do here quickly is just take this and jam all this stuff in here because I will make use of this backpack. This backpack right here is going to be very useful to me. Uh, let's open this up. Let's just throw all this stuff in there as well. Keep that. In fact, what I'll do is I'll put everything that I need in this bag right here. That, I need that. Need that. Need that. Need that. Need that. Lots and lots of stuff that I need here. Uh, I'm going to take that screwdriver. I'll take two of... Hmm. No, put that in there. What if I take this off? There we go. Put that in there. That in there. That in there. There. Everything should be a little bit more neater now. Just a little bit. Keep that grenade handy, because I'm always up for throwing some nades at things. There we go. That should be us fixed now. Put that in there. Hey, there we go. Sorted. Equip. There we go. And we'll grab that. We've also got we've got four prom mines, so let's go. And you know what? Let's go test out the prom mines. Because a lot of people seem to enjoy watching the, the, the puppets blowing up. 
So let's find a half decent place to. Oh, I know where we could go. I know where we could go. <laughs> I know where we could go. We need to turn around though. We need to go further. Where am I going here? We need to go further south. Further south, there's a there's a a what you may call it a thingamajig, a hangamajig. What's it called? A petrol station. That's what it's called. We're gonna go to the petrol station and then we're gonna lay out some prom mines and we're gonna watch the, the the puppets essentially run to us and blow up. That's what we're gonna watch here. Because I just want to make sure that they can, or at least they will, run to it and blow up. There's an ATV sitting right there. Oh my god, look at them all there. So many. Right, there's the petrol station just up ahead. I can just make out the buildings for it. There it is. Okie dokie. Yep, all the puppets spawned in there. i just seen them there. See them? can just make them out. Okay. So let's get the prom mines. Gimme, gimme. Uh, we'll just use two for... Just, just use two to start off with. We won't go overkill here. <laughs> a lot of people like to go overkill and drop like eight mines and stuff like that. Nope. I ain't wasting all these mines. I mean, I, what am I going to use them on, right? I'm in single player. What am I going to use them on? But still. But still. But still. Where did that unload to? Aha! Uh, stack in there. Okay! So I'm going to put them on the road. See what happens. So, arm trap. So if I do this... Right, I'm going to get a little bit of distance here. Oh, my God. That was a headshot. That was... Are these actually anti-personnel mines? Are these, like, anti-vehicle mines? Because these seem to be very powerful. Like, very powerful. <laughs> Is there any more? There should be a few more up here. There should be an extra beeper as well. Oh, there we are. Hmm, it's just one. I don't want to waste it on one. Maybe we should go to the city. Let's go to the city. We've got three more. One here, and we've got two in the other backpack. So let's grab those out and let's test them out, shall we? Uh, in here. Oh, not in there. Where are you? In here? Nope. In here? Haha. -ha. Give. Three beefy mines. Three big beefy mines. Right. Let's go test it out at the city, guys, because I'm feeling like uh, blowing stuff up today. I don't get to blow stuff up a lot. Mostly in the multiplayer server, I get to blow up stuff, but not in single player. I'm feeling like blowing some stuff up. I say that. In fact, we don't even have to go that far. Ooh, don't, 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 don't. There we go. We don't even have to go to the city. We could go to the little town. Uh, Delta 3 town. We could go there. Uh, these ones despawned. Okay, we're going to drive through Delta 3. Uh, Delta 3 town. Try and bait out all the, all the puppets. Lay down a mine. Shoot in the air and bait them towards the explosive. What could go wrong? Let's try it out. Ah. Oh boy, did you look look at them all render in? In fact, yeah, this is actually a pretty good spot actually. Right, 
stop here. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set one down right in front of this little barracks right here. See if I can bait them all towards it. There's plenty up ahead of me. Can I get up on top of that? Probably can't. Okay. Drop a mine right here. Arm trap. Okay. Let's go this way. Fight. Here we go. Oh my god. He's gonna run right at it. Huh? What? Oh, that's not good. That's not good. <laughs> what the hell happened? What? Okay, so I'm kind of confused now. Hmm. Did I even arm it? That's confusing. Hold on a second. Hold on a second here. Can it just be any random movement? Because if you can set this off with a, a stone... That, oh... I'd like to see if that's possible. Okay. Okay, so it seems that you can't set them off with stones. Nope, doesn't set up with stones. Okay, that's fine. Jump up! <laughs> Didn't know they did that. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh pain! 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 Top right trap kill. <laughs> God. Why? Why did it do that? Why? Why me? That was some radius in that explosion, by the way. I was all the way back and it still got me. That was some explosion. Oh my God. Imagine it set off the rest of the stuff in my bag. Like a chain reaction. Right, I'm going to quickly run back to my body, guys. Because <laughs> I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of embarrassed right now. <laughs> I should have known that was going to happen. Right, give me two seconds. Okay, I'm making it back to my body. I'm making it back to my body, but I've got people following me. I've got people following me. Oh, there's all the rocks. <laughs> it's my bloody body. Oh, my God. Give me my stuff. Give me my stuff. Give me my stuff. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm kind of embarrassed by that. I can't believe I did that to myself. That was just... I know it was dumb. I know it was dumb. But I didn't realise it would be that dumb. Right, you know? I didn't realise it would be like that. Oh my god! I get such a fright as well. <laughs> right. Okay. Fun's over. Fun's over. Die, thank you. Right, okay. Let's try this one more time. Let's try this one more time. I want to see if it'll work. Right. What is this on? I need this to be on auto uh, semi-automatic. On semi-automatic? Nope, we're on automatic. Burst. Okay. 
Let's try this again. Okay. Arm trap. Okay, it should not kill me from all the way back here, right? Right, let's try this. Oh my god, it's like a C4 explosion. It's like a C4 explosion! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Oh, that's so powerful. Um, I had I landed shots on him. There was blood coming off his face there, and it was not killing him. That's um, that's unreal. <laughs> that's that's a lot of power. That's a lot of firepower. Just just like that. J just just this alone. Just this alone is like that itself is scary it's literally a bouncing betty that's that's terrifying i i don't even know what to say about that that's this thing has got the capabilities of exploding like a c4 it's got the same sound you know it's got the same kind of explosive sound and it's probably got the same radius like 10 meter in diameter, five meter radius. This thing's mental. No wonder people use these in their bases actively. I wouldn't be surprised if people use these in their blooming, like, when they're trying to catch cars and stuff like that. My God, that's explosive power. Right, I'm not using them anymore. I'm not using them anymore. And it's probably a good thing now because that's the end of today's episode, ladies and gentlemen. Ra rather th short one today because of that kill box. I would have been there longer if it had given me like 30 minutes to play with it. But I think each time I fail, it takes time off me. Is that correct? If not, tell me in the comments. I can't believe that prom mine blew me up. It it just jumped up and it was like, hello. And then it killed me. It just, it, it annihilated me. It just completely annihilated me. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, if you've enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like on this video. Tell me what you think of it down in the comments below. You guys, how many of you use the prom mine and how many of you use the anti-personnel mines, the flat ones that you can stand on? How many people like the prom mines and how many people dislike the flat ones? Because I currently really like the prom mines, the bouncing betties. Deadly. If you've enjoyed today's episode that much and you're brand new to this channel, consider subscribing, ring the little bell, you'll stay up to date with episodes just like this, as well as Days Gone on Friday, as well as Sunday night streams. Alright ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go get a cup of tea, chill out, and probably lower my heart rate because of that bouncing Betty. I'm still kind of shaking from it. <laughs> anyway, I've been Mr. Feudal. Hope you'll have a lovely day. I'll see you all another time.